guys so today i have my package and this is going to be nanea and some of her accessories i'm just too excited to function right now because in here is nanea oh my god um i will probably do a voiceover for most of this just because i have to be kind of quiet right now um but i am still going to be talking in this video so people find voices or voiceovers annoying um but yeah i'm really excited let me open this ah, okay Her strings were replaced with like friendship bracelets and it was really annoying. I did return her. Um, so, and she also, she also had like rips on the doll's body. So, obviously, she didn't inc inc like disclose any of that information when I bought Jess. But um, hopefully, she didn't like, you know, omit anything when she was describing that nail. If so, I would be really, really disappointed. Sorry for that sound. Oh my god, I'm gonna open her accessories first. She came with two outfits um, and opened her last just because I'm super excited. And everything in this box cost me $114 shipped, and I will break down the prices later on. Oh my god, okay, this is this is her, but yeah. Um, yeah, she came with like an abundance of like, this is this is like good fabric. That she was using as like, like stuffing for the box, um, it's weird. Oh my god, look at this. This is just like the fabric that she packages, and I actually make doll clothes, so this is like, wow, this is like perfect. Look at this Hawaiian print fabric that she just she just included as like you know like packaging peanuts you know oh my god okay wow so she came with her book growing up with Aloha this is a lot thicker than some of the other books have been I don't know I haven't gotten a B Forever I've never gotten a B Forever book I haven't gotten a book in a while so this is her first outfit I don't know where her other outfit is maybe it's packaged with her so this box is for her Holoku dress which without tax is 34 at american girl and i got it for 22 including tax and everything which i thought was a really good deal oh this is the other dress <laughs> it's in here okay oh my god oh this is broken <laughs> it's whatever look this is the handmade one whoa this is cute see i'm not this talented at making doll clothes look at it okay so this is the top i'm gonna try all three outfits on her but like this is the top with the button ruffles that's cute right and it's like actually like it's sewn really nicely this is the back oh my gosh it has buttons i didn't even see I didn't see that my phone is going off like this feels really really nice and the pattern is so cute it's purple and like blue oh my gosh okay really excited so that's the first dress it looks it looks quite similar to like her it's such a nanea style I feel like the buttons and like uh, the pattern reminds me of the school outfit okay so this is her Holoku dress so it does come with oh she clipped it oh my god so it comes with the little hibiscus well it's not i don't think it's a hibiscus flower it's just a flower that is cute and it comes with her this is what is this called my lele oh that is that's an orchid flower clip and this is a my lele and it's just like the leaf lay you can see that is really cute and this is the holoku dress This is how it looks like oh my god i'm so excited to put this on her so it's sleeveless and it has little ruffles like so i'm sorry if like the lighting is super dark and then it has you know like the ruffles it has the ruffles and a little train that like sits oh my god okay so, those are all her outfits. Now I'm gonna open my Nanea doll. I'm so excited. She does have marks 
on her arms that the seller did ex uh, disclose but I just, oh my gosh I see her hair oh my god her hair looks beautiful oh my gosh okay she is wrapped really nicely and just the doll with her outfit and book cost me about $76 oh get this out of here oh yes Oh my god, this is Nanea. Can you see her? Oh my gosh. So she is described, let's see if she can stand, she can probably stand. Oh my god. There we go. Oh my god. Okay, so she is described as having tight limbs. It fell a little bit, but like, they're, they're, they're tight. Okay, so she does have, I can't stop staring at her face, the, her mold, wow, she has like no shine marks either, I'm sorry, you guys can't see. Alright, screw the stand, you guys need to look at her, oh my god, wait, what's the best lighting, here we go, best lighting, right here, oh my god, look at her eyes, they're the really pretty like dark green eyes. And it's her, it's the, oh, focus. Please focus. Okay, it's the best we can do. Like, she has like lashes, the tear ducts, she has the hooded eye look. Like that, her hooded eye is painted on. She has like her unique brows. Oh, I love her face mold. Wow. Okay, let's put her, let's stand her, and let me just do a little shot of her clothes. The color is like bent in, but I'm sure you guys know what her outfit looks like. Um, oh my god, I haven't touched, I haven't, I haven't even touched her hair yet. It feels really nice. She feels brand new. It's like she never even took the clip out. This is definitely a hibiscus flower. Look at that. Uh, look at that. Oh my god. And I know her hair also has, it's like black or brown, dark brown, with these like reddish highlights in it. And that's how my original hair looks like. I've, I've dyed it. But yeah, I don't, I don't know. I think that's like really cute. Her part is really to the side, which I really like. And let's just talk about her outfit. I love the buttons. Her, it's usually tucked in, I think. I'm gonna see how she looks like with her tucked in before I like switch her clothes and everything. But like, this is the top. These are the little pants. I think she comes with underwear. I'm not checking just yet. And these are her little sandals. So as you can see, she does have marks on her. I will try to take those off. Um, I will try to take these off, but I mean, it's just, it's not noticeable and I just don't care because I did not pay full price for her. So this is her other arm. It's not terrible though. Like the other, um, the Jess doll that I bought, it was so bad and she like didn't disclose any of it. Whereas this time she actually said that there were blue marks on her. I can't with her face though, like she looks gorgeous, I think. Okay, now I'm gonna um, change her. Or let's see what she looks like with her meat outfit tucked in. Oh my god. So I just wanted to show you kind of like meat outfit style. I think maybe I pulled the shorts a little bit too high. Um, wait. Yeah. <laughs> okay, can I just say, like, I'm obsessed with this outfit. I think this is by far one of the, like, my favorite meat outfits that any Be Forever doll has come in. Just because it's it's a lot more modern than, like, the gowns and stuff that other characters come with. Oh, I love the detail. So pretty. So now I'm going to change her. And while I was kind of pulling up her shorts, she does have the underwear with her as well. 
So yeah, I was pulling down her like the boxer underwears that she does come with and I did notice a couple of things. So let me just pull this down all the way. If you can see, very obviously, she still has the plastic around her legs, which is so impressive because literally this is this doll is like almost brand new and I got her for such a discount. Sorry, let me just take these off. Um, but she does have like I see one mark right there and then I see one mark right here. I will try to take those off, but it doesn't look like there's any other ones. So in all, not bad. So she also has the new polyester fiber body and I know a lot of people don't like it, but honestly like I think it is worse quality, but as long as you don't scratch it, I think it's fine. It's not enough for me to not want her. And I mean, she's wearing clothes most of the time anyways. And since she is the new body, she also has the zip tie on the back. And here I have dressed her in her Holoku outfit. She is wearing the purple dress with the My Lele and the pink flower in her hair. I think the dress is absolutely gorgeous. It looks amazing on her. At the neckline, we have like these little ruffles that just look really, really adorable and in true authentic style. I also think it's really, really cute how her lei matches the colors of her eyes. Uh, they're both this like dark gray that's dark gray, dark green that's really, really pretty. And the bright pink orchid flower is, of course, absolutely gorgeous. So this is the back of her, as you can see, uh, she has her train. This is the only American Girl doll dress that I've ever seen with the train. She also has her hair down and wavy and gorgeous. Uh, I just wanted to give you a closer look at the little ruffles and the little pink pattern, just cause it's just, it's so pretty and unique and I love it. This is her in the handmade school outfit. I'm gonna call it a school outfit because that's what it's similar to. I think the colors, the pastel purple and green and blue just work so well with her. Um, the details on this handmade dress is so intricate that it's just, it's really impressive. Again, here's her from the back. It is closed by buttons, but like her uh, meat outfit, her meat top actually, which is pretty cool. And this outfit came out to about $16. I also took her hair out of the clip, which I think I took it out for the first time. Um, I feel like with her hair down, she just looks a lot more modern, and I absolutely love it. The little poof in front of her, uh, like a face, I think it looks absolutely adorable. I also gave you a closer look at the highlights in her brown hair. I think it's really, really pretty, and it just suits her perfectly. I also gave you a closer look at her gorgeous green eyes. I think they suit her medium skin tone perfectly. And of course, you cannot forget about her brows and her eye paint. I feel like it makes her super duper unique and special. But that is it. This is everything that I got today. I got her Holoku outfit, her meat outfit, and of course, the handmade school dress. And of course, her. She is absolutely gorgeous. And I hope you found this video interesting useful maybe i don't know um but yeah stay tuned for a lot more to come with my new nanea doll again thank you guys so much for watching until then i'll talk to you next time bye